This video is brought to you by John Screen Service in Wellington, Florida, and we're talking today about the problems you have with birds and ducks and various uh, fairly large fowl on your screen enclosure. There can be a lot of these ducks at one time or birds of various sources, sorts, and the bigger the birds, obviously, the, the bigger the mess they make. Here's one solution. This is made by um, Bird Barrier Company, and this is called a Daddy Long Legs. I just call them spiders, and they wave around and they kind of scare the uh, the birds away. And they're somewhat effective, and nothing's totally effective. So it just sometimes we put a dozen of these things on a screen enclosure, and it's still the birds find a way to to not be bothered by them. Uh, one, this is, is a, a a different picture of the same ones and along here is a different kind. See on this enclosure we've put two different kinds of deterrents, bird deterrent things and this is a, like a piano wire that's held up by these little posts to try to keep the birds from standing on the railing or the, the metal. This little metal part here is called a purlin and this here is called a beam they're not very wide. This is only two inches wide, and so the birds uh, try to park themselves any place. There are other solutions that they come up with, which is a gel, which is sticky, which would be put all along here, or along there. But that is, uh, it never gets totally dry, and so you can't get that off. So that's not a good solution. Also, another solution that they've come up with, uh, like electrical current, like uh, which would be set along here, but you can't take that up either. Uh, and anything that you put on a screen enclosure to distract the birds has to be removable. Uh, let's look at a couple more. Here's spikes. These are glued down. They also begin screwed down, but um, this is not a screen enclosure. It's some sort of beam that was put up there. That's not very uh, workable either and this is a, a, a what they call a coil. All these things work somewhat for various purposes but not for screen enclosures. So another uh, you have to remember that anytime you put anything on there uh, here's the guy having to walk on there. Here's John walk on here um, on the screen enclosure. See this is only two inches wide. Well if you have anything on this ledge when the, the, somebody's trying to fix your screen here you can't have something in the way because you don't want them to get off balance it's it's a, a pretty precarious for anybody to be working up here to begin with and to put anything in the way would is not a good idea here are the two guys that are working on top of this. This is a two-story screen enclosure. What if you had something, you know, a stumbling block or anything that had to work around? They just not only walk on these these beams and these two to four inch pieces of, you know, 20 feet up in the air or 12 or however tall your screen enclosure is, but they have to work. They have to stoop down and they have to take screen out and put it back in and all sorts of stuff. So uh, hindering that in any way is uh, just doesn't work. The problem is that you put it up there and now a screen comes out. Well, you've gone to the expense of putting that bird deterrent up there. Now you have to go to the expense of the 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 screen guy having to take it off and then replace it or do something so it's a lot more cost because of the double work than you would expect so just keep that in mind here's another picture see John is here working on the edge of somebody's screen enclosure and this is a small screen enclosure and um, it's only like 10 feet tall or something but you still if you had bird uh, deterrence there along the edge had to be taken down because you cannot you don't want to have anything that would uh, keep somebody from working on your enclosure and if you did they would just have to take it down and replace it and most of the time it cannot be replaced except this which I call the spiders the um, 
daddy long legs can be ta unscrewed and put back on and the piano wire can be taken down and put back up but all that is a cost i hope this has been helpful to you this has been brought to you by john screen service in wellington florida thanks for coming goodbye now